Welcome to the Smite God Reveal for Fenrir the Unbound. Mortals must rely on the wisdom of the gods, but never forget they are fallible. They can be petty, churlish, and worst of all, wrong. What are the consequences for their mistakes? They should have slain the wolf beast Fenrir, but they chose instead to bind him. Despite the warnings and prophecies he would tear Odin apart at Ragnarok and devour the earth and sky, they did not end Loki's son. Now terror roams free. It is unknown how, but Fenrir is unbound. Thrice they tried to bind him, each time convincing Fenrir that the chains were nothing more than a challenge for his strength, a test to see if he could shatter them. The first two god-forged fetters were easily broken beneath the beast's terrible power, but the third was a ribbon, dwarf-made, and Fenrir grew suspicious of the gods' intentions. As a show of faith, he demanded one of them place a hand in his mouth, and if the ribbon proved magical in nature, he would exact punishment. Brave, if foolish, Tyr put his fist in Fenrir's maw as the ribbon was secured to the wolf's leg. Fenrir strained and screamed, but could not break free, and in a rage he devoured Tyr's hand. For a time, Fenrir was forgotten. The dire prophecy, just a memory. But they were all warned, and the gods did nothing. Fenrir is hungry now, the first hunter, an alpha among sheep. But no flesh will satisfy his need. It is revenge he craves, and now he is unbound. In Smite, Fenrir tears his opponents apart as a physical melee bruiser. Fenrir's passive is called Unbound Runes. Fenrir gains efficiency as he attacks. Every hit from a basic attack activates one rune, up to a max of five. Each of Fenrir's abilities gain an additional benefit when used at maximum runes, and the runes are consumed. Enemy gods that die near Fenrir will fully activate all of his runes. His first ability is called Unchained. Fenrir leaps forward, dealing damage to all enemies when he lands. At full runes, the leap stuns the enemy's hit. If the leap hits a god, the cooldown is halved. His second ability is called Seething Howl. Fenrir rears back and howls, inspiring himself with a physical power and lifesteal buff. At full runes, the buff is increased by 50%. Fenrir's third ability is called Brutalize. Fenrir pounces to his ground target location. If there was an enemy in the radius, he strikes them four times, dealing additional damage with each strike. At full runes, each strike deals 75% damage to nearby enemies. Fenrir's ultimate is called Ragnarok. Upon activation, Fenrir grows massive in size, becoming immune to crowd control while moving faster. Fenrir bites enemy gods, dealing physical damage and carrying them away. At five combo points, his protections double. In this fight, Cervic initiates on Aphrodite at their tower. Fenrir jumps on Cervic, brutalizing him with four quick strikes. Activating Ragnarok, he then picks up Sobek and brings him back to their tower for the kill. In this second scenario, Fenrir and Aphrodite are running out of the jungle behind the enemy. Fenrir activates Seething Howl and then brutalizes Sobek. He activates his ultimate and bites him for the kill before turning towards Anhur and finishing him off for the double kill. And finally, this fight has Fenrir and Aphrodite engaging against Surfin, Hebo, and Ra. Fenrir chases down Hebo, but he gets sidetracked by his surfboard and grabs that instead. Hebo, being such a hardcore surfer, continues to ride the wave even though a huge wolf is fetching his board. Once he drops, Hebo tries to run, but Fenrir ends up brutalizing him in the end.
As the Unbound, Fenrir initially relies on the guaranteed four-hit combo of his Brutal Eyes. Not only can it help him damage enemy gods, but it is also a great farming tool. Next, picking up Unchained is a great idea for both initiation and escape purposes. From there, the priorities shift to Ragnarok, Brutal Eyes, Seething Howl, Unchained. Hang ten with all the new Surf and Hebo skin. On the hunt for a free skin, follow at Smite to get the Stalker skin. It's also a brand new day for the Sun God. Rise and shine with a fresh take on Raw. Call out voice commands like the god you are. This update introduces a voice pack for Neath, with more coming in future updates. Be careful, middle! I'll gank right lane! Enemies at the fire giant! Attack fire giant! Lastly, you can now spectate your friends in-game. Thanks for watching the Smite God reveal for Fenrir, the Unbound.